Okay, what we're going to do now, we're going to go into this list again and we're going to really look at it and make it solid in your mind so you can use it for your practical applications. First thing you want to do is make sure you know the list from 1 to 20. And then next, you want to make sure it's a solid representation of each picture, which means the tree. What kind of tree is it? Okay, is it an elm tree, oak tree, weeping willow tree, a Christmas tree? It's your tree. Form it in your mind and make it solid, and that's going to be your tree from from here on in. Light switch. I like to use a room that goes from light to dark. What room is it? A stool. All the images. The car. The glove. Everything. Okay. Make sure you take the time to put those images in your mind in a solid way. So when you use them, they're formed. Okay. So you don't got to think about if I, if I say seven, you don't say oh, ooh, seven. Now you know that seven is dice, and you've made some representation that f really fixes the word and image of dice in the mind to be ready to be used for your technique. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to give you some facts that we're going to peg on to this list, okay? And time will not allow me to do all uh, 20. I'm going to do 10 right now, and I'll let you just take your time to do the rest on your own. I'm going to use uh, 10 facts about President Obama, and these are fun facts. So we're going to use these facts, and we're going to peg them to the list from 1 to 10, okay? So let's start from number 1. Number 1, the fact of Obama is his favorite magazine, or his favorite comic book, um, are um, Spider-Man and Conan the Barbarian. So we're going to have is we're going to have Obama standing in front of a tree, reading a comic book, and he's laughing, because he sees Spider-Man is is um, putting his webs on Conan the Barbarian, attaching him to the tree, and Conan the Barbarian is taking his sword or his axe and he's slicing the webs and he's yelling, and Spidey continues to hit him with the webs. And so that's the image we see. It's crazy, it's grandiose, and you see Obama and you hear him laughing and he's got the magazine or the comic book and he's standing there. So that's going to be number one. Number two is dark. Light comes on. The fact is Obama, when he was in school, he was he was nicknamed Obama because of his ability to play basketball. And so we're going to have the light come on, and you see Obama dressed as a bomber, and he has um, his bombs. He's throwing them at a basketball net, and they're exploding. Okay, so it's Obama. It works. Okay, it's number two. Number three is going to be a stool. Uh, this fact is Obama's favorite meal is Michelle's shrimp linguine. So we're going to have Obama and Michelle sitting on a stool with just a gigantic shrimp coming at them and pouring linguine on top of their head. Okay, and they're throwing the linguine at each other, making a fun mess of it all as they're sitting on this stool. Okay, very quick, easy, it's coming at you. Uh, the fourth one is going to be a car. Okay, the, the, the fact here is that in 2006, Obama won um, a Grammy for his recording of the book. Dreams from my father. Okay, so we're gonna have Obama driving a car, and he sl he sleeps at the wheel, so he crashes the car, and you see like a dream bubble come up, and it's his father handing him a Grammy. Okay, that seems I got that that worked for me. Okay, make it solid for yourself. Okay, that's number four. Number five is going to be the glove. So we're gonna imagine that Obama is standing, holding his hand up, and he has a um. His left hand is is up in the air, and he has six fingers on his left hand. Okay, he like maybe swearing himself in or something like that. But he has his, his left hand up, and he has six fingers on his left hand. And behind him is a uh, is a soldier. He is surrendering, and, his, and the bare war ends. Okay, uh, the fact is that Obama is the sixth post-war president to be left-handed. Okay, number that was number five. This is number six. Number um, number six is going to be a gun. Okay, so we're going to have Obama staying on the on the lawn of the um, White House, and he's throwing books in the air, and he's shooting them with the gun, and they're flying everywhere. Papers flying everywhere, it's making a mess. And you see Harry Potter around, and he's he's part of this here because the the fact is that Harry Potter books, Obama has read every one of them. Okay, so he's throwing up in the air, he's shooting him, and Harry Potter's flying around, and all the characters from the book, okay? So that's going to be your sixth image. Number seven, I'll first give you the 
picture. It's going to be um, Obama has these giant dice. He's hanging them to Muhammad Ali, who's, who has on these red gloves, and he is autographing the dice. So the fact is that Obama has a pair of red boxing gloves autographed by Muhammad Ali. So he is handing Muhammad Ali some giant dice with his red gloves, and he is autographing it, these for Obama. Number eight, we have skates. Okay, the fact is, um, when Obama was a teenager, he worked at Bass and Robbins, and now he can't stand ice cream. So the picture is going to be a bunch of teenagers skating around Obama, taunting him, throwing ice cream at him, and he is he's hate, he hates it. He's mad. He's got a grimace on his face, and they're throwing ice cream at Obama, and that's going to let you know that when he was a teenager. He worked at Baskin Robbins, and now he doesn't like ice cream. Okay, moving on. Number nine. It's got a cat now, right? Okay. Um, we're gonna have a cat. He's choking on a fur ball or a hair ball, and it comes out. And it is a, um, it a, it is a chocolate peanut butter power bar instead of being a hair ball. And Obama likes. It. He takes it and he says, "Great, I love these." The fact is that Obama's favorite snack food is chocolate peanut butter power bars all right so that's number nine number ten is a bowling alley and you see obama he's got a gigantic bowling ball and says indonesia on it and he's throwing it at a dog a snake and grasshoppers um eating roasted peanuts okay um the fact is that when he was in the, when he was in indonesia he ate dog meat snake meat and roasted grasshoppers Okay, so those are your 10 facts. Now, again, this is quick. You can re rewind this and watch it again. But the point is, these should be solid in your mind because not of the, the facts alone, but the images that were in it. You, you see him throwing the bowling ball at the dog and, and the snake and the grasshoppers, and they're bouncing around with the, with, with the roasted nuts. Uh, you should see the uh, cat with the fur ball, which is really a um, chocolate peanut butter power bar. You should see the children with the ice cream you should, you should see all the images okay so let's very quickly I got time here let's go over these facts again I'm going to just first of all just note the pictures and then we'll note what the fact is number one we see a tree with Spider-Man putting webs over coming the barbarian and he's cutting himself off and then he's putting web, web back on him and the mom standing with a, um, a magazine or a comic book and he's laughing because the fact is that his favorite comic book is Spider-Man and Conan the Barbarian. Number two, light switch comes on, lights turned on, you see um, Obama throwing a bomb at a basketball net and explodes. He was called Obama when he played um, basketball. Number three, so you see a stool, right? You see a giant shrimp pouring linguine on Obama and his wife Michelle because his favorite meal is Michelle's shrimp linguine. Number four is a car. Obama's driving the car. He crashes the car, and you see a dream bubble comes up. It's his father handing him a, a, a Grammy uh, because he won a Grammy in '06 for the um, audio version of "Dreams from My Father." Okay, '06 is something that's just in there. I don't have to really make it, it part of the image. That was number uh, four. And number five is the glove. So we see Obama putting his hand up. He's got um, his left hand, six fingers. And there's a, a soldier swinging in the back and says, war is over. So we know that Obama is left-handed. He's the sixth post-war president to be left-handed. And that, of course, again, was number five. Number six, uh, we have Obama standing in the, in the front of the White House with a gun. He's shooting books. Harry Potter flying around. He has read every Harry Potter book. Okay. Number seven, we have dice. We have Muhammad Ali. got them signed the dice. Uh, he has a red... Um, some autograph boxing glove from Muhammad Ali. Number eight, we see skates. So kids skating around ice cream. He's just like he's grimacing. So we know that when he was a teenager, he worked at Bass and Robbins, and to this day he doesn't like ice cream. Okay. Number nine, we see a cat. Got got the fur ball, hair ball, coughing it up, and it's a um, it's a chocolate peanut power ball or power ball <laughs> um, power bar. Okay. Um, so that reminds us that his favorite snack food is the chocolate peanut butter power bar. Very good. Um, number 10, bowling ball. 
and we have him throwing the bowling ball at a dog, a snake, and a grasshopper eating roasted nuts. So we know that in Indonesia, matter of fact, on the ball says Indonesia. So in Indonesia, he ate dog meat, snake meat, and roasted grasshoppers while in Indonesia. And it goes on from there. Okay. And if you want, um, the 11th fact was that Obama could speak Spanish. So you can take that and put it on number 11 at, at your own uh, time. So you see how this works. And these facts, not only are they not only are they uh, seen by the images, but they're also remembered by the words. Okay, so I think it helps for you to really see the sentences and then make the images and then say it and use all your senses. Okay, so that's it for this time. I want you to really make sure you understand what I'm doing by practicing it. Please comment, let me know that this is working for you because this is a great technique. I use it all the time. And I'd like to um, invite you to just create your own list of 20 things and have fun, make better grades, really impress yourself with what you can learn. Okay? So until next time, as always, thank you and you have a great day.